The Gambia Press Union GPU Awards Committee convened a press conference on Friday to provide the public with an update on the forthcoming National Journalism Awards. These awards, organized annually by the Gambia Press Union, are organized as the most prestigious journalism accolades in the Gambia. The ceremony serves as a tribute to the courage and outstanding work of Gambian journalists across various media platforms, encompassing print, online, radio, television, and photography. During the press conference, Ms. Isa Duketa, chairperson of the awards committee, announced that the National Journalism Awards Ceremony is scheduled for December 16, 2023. Ms. Keta also outlined the eligibility criteria for journalists seeking consideration for these prestigious awards. For this year, preparations are on the way to stage the event on the 16th of December. Eligibility for the awards extends to all Gambian journalists employed by registered Gambian-based media outlets and platforms. Works authored by Gambian journalists for international media are also eligible. Additionally, entries must have been produced between the 1st of January 2022 and the 31st of December 2022, and they must have been published in Gambian registered media outlets. Please take note that opinion pieces, advertorials, content generated under commercial contracts for promotional purposes and newsletter items or articles are not eligible for sub submission. The chairperson of the awards committee also disclosed the available categories for journalists to compete for in this year's awards. Now the 2023 awards committee is delighted to announce that this year's ceremony will feature 17 distinct categories excluding the special awards, which is, we know, do understand that GPU also has its own special awards that we, they recognize media individuals. That is not for any um, category that is up for submission or to be nominated for. So for in this aspect, GT, G, the GPU special awards is in the recognition of outstanding journalist, journalistic achievements. So the respective categories for this year's awards are business and financial reporting award, sports reporting award, Environment Reporting Award, Investigative Reporting Award, Health and Medical Reporting Award, Women's Reporting Award, Children's Reporting Award, Travel and Tourism Reporting Award, Culture, Arts and Entertainment Reporting Award, Agriculture Reporting Award, Political Reporting Award, Human Rights Reporting Award, Legal Affairs Reporting Award, Photojournalism Award, Journalist of the Year Award, Community Rural Radio Reporter of the Year, and also Security Reporter of the Year. This is the newest category that was added in this year's award, considering the fact of security situations and the amount of reports that have been produced by journalists in the aspect of security, security in the Gambia, taking cue of the recent SSR that is ongoing in the Gambia. Ms. Keta mentioned that her committee is currently in the final stage of accepting stories for the awards. So the awards committee is in the final is actually in will in due um, is in the final stages of preparing to accept applications for the various award categories and we aim to do so at the earliest convenience. So to stay updated on crucial deadlines and essential information regarding the 2023 awards, we encourage you to follow up our social media channels: Facebook at GPU Awards, Instagram at GPU Awards, Twitter at GPU Awards, and also visit our website at www.gpuawards.gm. In alignment with its fundamental mission to elevate professional standards within the Gambia media scene, the Gambia Press Union has been organizing the National Journalism Awards since 2016. This endeavor aims to inspire and energize journalists to continually pursue excellence in their specific domains. The awards committee for this year consists of seven members with Ms. Isa Ducator serving as the committee chairperson Mr. Famara Jaune as the vice chairperson, Ms. Annette Kamara overseeing communications and brands, Mr. Buba Fati and Ms. Tres Gomez handling fundraising, Mrs. Mambintanjai providing IT support for the website and other entries, and Mr. Aliusise responsible for logistics. Reporting for Kerfatu, I am Landin Sise.